I'm Nan Bryan, former Madison School Board member. I have had three children who have graduated from Madison schools and currently have grandchildren who are attending Madison Public Schools. And I have a question for Madison Prep. Why do it separately if we can do it together better? Both the supporters of Madison Prep and members of the Madison Board of Education and staff want better outcomes for students of color and low-income students. Rather than begin two separate schools at a West Side Madison church, why not use existing Madison middle schools for this program? If single gender classes are a good idea, the girls of Madison Prep could attend a Madison middle school, the boys of Madison Prep could attend another West Side Madison middle school. We would save money on administrative cost, facility cost, maintenance costs. Those dollars could be used to better serve more of our students. But more importantly than the dollars saved is the fact that if these schools were located within the Madison schools, it is more likely that we could transfer successful strategies to other district schools. Witness Nuestro Mundo, a successful dual immersion language charter school that was begun and still exists at Frank Alice Elementary School. That dual immersion program has been successfully transported and exported to five other Madison Elementary schools. Also, if Madison Prep is successful as a middle school, it is likely that those students will navigate Madison High School successfully. If that is the case, we may be decide that it is better to transfer the Madison Prep idea to Madison Elementary Schools because as research shows, early is better. There is no question that we need to do more to serve many of our students, but we are more likely to succeed if we try and then broadly expand strategies that work for the most students.